what is up guys today I will be bringing you a tutorial and kind of a review of a skin for Android this is a really interesting skin because it combines the simplicity of a Windows 7 phone with the hardware of an Android as most of you guys know when Microsoft launched the Windows 7 phone they stated that they want the same specs across all kinds of devices which made it kind of boring and made Windows Phone sorta of unattractive. But with the simplicity of the Windows Phone, which is really good and some say comparable to of the iPhone and the Android, which usually have the best hardware, we're gonna take a look. So this does not require any sort of jailbreaking routing or whatnot. And let's get on to it. So first we're gonna unlock it. Here, let's go to the Android market. As you can see, I've already had it pulled up. But anyway, let's go ahead and tap. And the app is called Launcher 7. Go ahead and tap that. So they have two versions of this app. One is the donate version, another one is the free version. The donate version basically means that there will be no ads when you scroll down the list of apps. But for this demonstration purpose, I'll be using the free version. So let's go ahead and tap that. And download. Accept and download. Alright, it's downloaded. That was pretty quick. And so the moment you press, you hit the home button, you'll get this option to complete the action using either the stock, the stock Android that came with your phone, or you can use the new Launcher 7. Let's go ahead and use set as default, Launcher 7. Immediately what you're gonna get is the Metro UI that's really well known for Windows Phone right here we have the phone app the messaging app the internet app with a logo of the Google Chrome music app Android market contacts and videos what you basically do is you swipe to the side if you hit the donate button just now and bought the donated version, you won't have the apps right here. But since I don't, here are the ads. It's not that intrusive. And so it should be fine. So here you have your apps. You can quickly find them by hitting this button and choosing which one you want to go right away to. So this is really all there is to the phone. You can hit contacts. You can pin stuff to the to the home screen. For example, I'm gonna pin Dolphin Browser Browser HD for Android, which is a really really great browser. Go ahead and hit that, and pin it to the home screen. Here, you get a bunch of options, and then we're gonna hit the very last button, which is click to add tile. So here it is. Let's go ahead and add another one. Let's add Angry Birds. Once again, pin to home screen. And here, let's take a closer look at the options that they give you. The title Angry Birds. You can change the title, you can change it to. You can. Oops. You can let's say change it to Michael or whatever. Alright, hit OK. The tile size, one by one was the one you just saw with the Dolphin Browser HD. Two by one would make it horizontal and one by two will make it vertical. Let's try this. And then tile color, you have the option to choose the color. Let's not go with the boring green, let's go with something like blue. All right, blue color, 
extra op options yeah so the tall should be added by now oops where is it right there it is but the thing is so that's a really pretty cool skin if you don't really like the android or just want to add some flavor to your android device but um it's really really too simple i mean and there's some bugs like for example if you move it to the side you can just pull it by holding it on the right hand of the screen and then swiping in the side but if you want to go back to the home screen there's no way you can do this sorry about that so you oh you do you can do that Ooh, that's an interesting feature yeah but anyway other than that this is a really great way to either give your device a new look or just experimenting with something you have never done before so other than that thank you so much for watching today it's your host michael leon and until the next video see you later folks